Welcome to Paranormal Night Shift, your fan stories told here. Do you believe that energies, spirits, ghosts, possessions are self-aware? And if so, how aware are they? And how much can they control? David writes in, I work for one of the largest shipping yards in Delaware. It's been the site of several fires and all they ever do is rebuild. And there's a pretty weird history behind it. Normally, when these statements are made, the word allegedly follows them, but there's no alleged about it. The land used to be a mass grave. They dug everything up and moved it. Public record, and it's very well known. See, the company bought the land, started digging, come across a lot of bodies, and instead of just leaving it be, they moved them. In the hundred years of our company being on this land, we've had two major fires. Countless unexplained incidents, power outages, equipment just magically breaking. But here's my story. Very open to the idea of spirits. And I try to be respectful of the things that I know the company did because, well, I wasn't the one who did them. But when weird and spooky stuff happens, I tend to talk to the spirits. My coworkers think I'm absolutely crazy, but I know that you don't meddle with things that you shouldn't meddle with. And for as silly as it sounds, I hope that respect goes a long way. We finally built two separate buildings, and there's a long shipyard in between the buildings. The old building, which is the one that was built on top of the graveyard, and the new building. It's about a hundred yards. Nobody likes to walk it, especially at night. A couple of years back, the company decided to be more energy efficient, so all the lights outside on the loading dock are now motion activated. So when you go out there at three o'clock in the morning, you kind of have like a long hallway of lights that come on as you're walking. They're very sensitive. It actually takes a couple minutes for them to actually kick on. That's why nobody likes going that way. I'm walking and the lights are slowly coming on. And then I notice that in the opposite direction, lights are coming on too. I call out, hey, who's there? See, cause I'm the only one who's supposed to be there. Yeah, it's still a little dark, but I don't see anything and the lights start coming on very fast, coming straight towards me, light after light after light start coming on. It's faster than I've ever seen these lights come on, and whatever is triggering them is running at me as fast as it can. Whatever is coming at me has no more than 50 feet away from me. I finally break it down in the fetal position and I scream, I'm sorry for what they did to you, and it stops. It's like it knew that I wasn't the one who did it. We caught it all on CC, and unfortunately I can't send it to you, but now my company is far more respectful to the ghost. Well, thank you for your story, and that, my friend, is definitely worth a Paranormal Night Shift sticker. Tell me in the comments, do you think you should be respectful to the spirits?